My name's Stephen O'Keefe. I'm the Program Director for the Bachelor of Engineering and Bachelor of Aviation double degree. My name's Mish and I'm studying a Bachelor of Engineering and Aviation at Griffith Uni. Hi, I'm Michael. I'm studying Bachelor of Aviation and Bachelor of Engineering. So students in both of our aviation engineering programs are coming to Archfield Airport to undertake a course where they'll actually learn about avionics in real aircraft. They'll be working on real aircraft systems and they'll even be flying professional simulators so that they can understand how that avionics works in real life. So right now we're at our Archfield Airport, we're at Flight 1, so this is our flight training facility. Today we've been playing around with the simulator, it's only three in Queensland, it's been really fun. In the simulator here at Flight 1, they've been giving us procedural failures that we need to address and troubleshooting as a team, just to try and understand how the plane works. As a child, I always wanted to pursue aviation as a career. I wanted to do the double because I've always been interested in engineering and Aviation was something I always wanted to do. I've always been more inclined towards uh, the aviation side. My old, my old boy is actually an engineer, so he actually encouraged me to do this course, but it's the first time this course has been offered, and I thought, oh, this is going to be a great opportunity. I hope to be a commercial pilot, but um, doing the dual course, I would like to have a second background. Door, yeah. uh, having a double degree in engineering and aviation gives our graduates a, a great advantage when they get out to work. They have two strings to their bow, so they can work as an engineer in the aviation industry or they can work as a pilot with an engineering qualification. So both of them puts them to the front of their area. So production pilots, for example, working with large companies uh, manufacturing aircraft will always have a flight qualification and an engineering qualification. We have a bit more training with understanding how the instruments work, you know, not just the sort of base value of them, what's happening behind the instruments of the cockpit. For the Bachelor of Engineering, that's the four-year course, and the aviation is integrated within that, so it's an accelerated program. So in our fifth year, we do a graduate diploma in flight management, so as part of that final year of this degree, that's when we start getting up some flight hours. So by the end of the five year period, I will be a qualified commercial pilot. Griffith is the only uni that offers the double degree in engineering and aviation. 